Grenville Pinto, who's now sitting down and chatting with me. Great to have you here, Grenville. Thank you. It is always a pleasure. Likewise. So we've just been chatting a little bit, and I got to know a little bit more about Grenville Hamilton, born and raised. Born and raised. And, yes. and, and we were just chatting. You have been, uh, you know, surrounded by the Italian community from the beginning. Since I was a little boy. Yes. Surrounded by Italians. Most of my friends are Italian. <laughs> I hope they're watching right now. Uh, and my my good buddies, good families. Uh, I, they've all been, you know, I've I've uh, I've been raised eating pasta and lasagna. And yes. Mixing it with, with, with a little bit of, um, you know, samosas on the side. You need a flavor on the yeah. side. <laughs> well, very good. Well, you know what? You are such a, a great talent. You can hear that with your music. Obviously, these influences uh, and your upbringing, you hear in your oh, music. You. Um, let's talk a little bit about that. So you've been playing for a really long time. You've been playing, and your family plays as well. Yes, they do. I started around seven. Actually, maybe five. My mother started us all playing playing piano first, playing keyboards. Was, that, was it important to your family, like your mom, for you guys to, to learn music? I think it was. Yeah. Both my, my, my parents, my father and my mother, are musically inclined. Mm. My mother plays piano, so she taught us when we were young. And my two sisters, they play keyboards. And my older sister, Christabel, plays accordion. Accordion. So, that perfect Italian band right there. Yes. So, <laughs> yeah, we got quite the eclectic mix I love of music that. that was going on in our, in our household. Very and good. very ethnic influenced yeah. as well. From all sides. And so, you know, we hear you and we hear you play some of the classics and some of the notable songs that mm -hmm. we know, but you also write your own music and create your own music. Yes, I do. You've been doing that for a while as well. Yes, I have, uh, actually, and I was doing it unintentionally when I was uh, when I was young. And on my new album, which we were discussing, which will be released mm -hmm. in 2019, has a song where I was just messing around on my guitar when I was a, like a teenager, I guess. And it was a little riff that I came up with. And I've now turned that into a full-blown song. And we shot a music video in really? Europe oh, wow. uh, to go with it. And you'll be seeing that in the coming months. Well, speaking of Europe, has, has your music, I'm assuming it's taken you around the world. Have you performed in a lot of places? I've been fortunate. I've my The, the, the producer of my last album was, was Pablo. Oh, yes. We know him by quite yeah. been here several times as well. Pablo's yeah. a, great, a great man. And yeah. uh, we work together. And his, uh, he has a special. He has a DVD special. It was uh, it aired on, on and is airing on on PBS. PBS, yes. And it's live in Castoria. That's his father's hometown. Mm -hmm. So he brought me along as a guest, wow. and I was fortunate enough to play in Greece. And and now it's gone. Now it's airing throughout North America, actually, as we speak. What does I mean? I, I always, you know, I'm amazed with, when it comes to this kind of art form. What does it do for you when you when you're? Are, does it? Are you? Are you? Pre, how are you present in that moment when you're playing? Oh. Are you? Are you somewhere else? Are you in that moment? Are you? Does your music take you? Because you're just. It's just seamless. It's just. It's beautiful. That's a nice question, <laughs> actually, to ask. It's kind of. Um, it's not something which I think about. It's like second nature. If you walk or something, I feel like it's in my DNA mm -hmm. or something, or it's just in my blood. And I just, uh, I just love music so much. So I try and speak through my instrument. And yeah, there's a clip right there, which was taken about a month ago. Well, this is an event that we were at. This is a Brilliant Minded Women's event. And you were performing. You were fantastic. Um, even did a little bit of Phantom of the Opera in costume, which was great. Right. But you had, actually, you, um, you had quite the fan at this event. No. Uh, which we were so proud to showcase. And I, I, I've been talking about that moment to so many people, even just yesterday, even just last night, uh, with you performing. Um, and that's with Mayor Hazel McCallion. That's right, there she is. How did that moment happen? You were saying you didn't, it wasn't expected, she just showed up? Well, she was at the event, she was being recognized. Mm -hmm. And this was for an event called Brill Brilliantly Minded Women. That's right. And of course, she had to be there. Just yes. fits the title so appropriately. And I did not think this was going to happen, though, but she really lives up to her name of Hurricane Hazel. Yes. What a lovely woman <laughs> and a lovely vibe that evening. Well, you were very entertaining for her and for all of us in the audience. Uh, really quickly, you have an, an album coming out, you mentioned in 2019. Looking yes. forward to that. But you do, you are performing today from uh, Perfect Day, right? And you Correct. were also performing, you're going to perform a little bit later, you're going to perform a Christmas, Christmas Glow. There's a song in your particular that means a lot to you that you also wrote that you wanted to share. Yes, that song is called A Star Shining Brightly, and it's a song I wrote in, uh, in memory of my mother, and it appears on my, on my Christmas album, Christmas Glow. 
So uh, we want to thank you again for being a part thank of our show. Uh, you're not done yet. You're still going to perform. There's still more Grenville Pencil coming up on our program. And uh, and I just want to thank you again for sharing your love of, of music and your love of this art. Thank, thank you very you. much. Thank you. We're going to take a short break right now. versione diciamo così originale quindi la scopriamo insieme that's right an original from Grenville Pinto from Perfect Day enjoy we'll be right back at the Evie Chip Show. Vogliamoci bene. Assai, assai, assai. Bye, everybody. Grenville Pinto. Woo! <laughs> 